Welcome to another quick info. Today I'm going to talk about Motoko Kusunagi from Ghost in the Shell, created by Masamune Shiro. Her first appearance in the manga called Ghost in the Shell is 1989. Motoko is a cyborg and a highly skilled special operative, served as a leader of Public Security Section 9, a government task force specializing in cyber warfare and counter terrorism. Motoko's cybernetic body allows her to possess superhuman strength, agility, and durability. Her brain are the only organic part remaining. It's housed in a synthetic shell called Cyberbrain, giving her the ability to connect directly to the computer network and access vast amount of information. This advanced cyberization arises essential questions about identity, consciousness, and the boundary between humanity and technology, which are the main term of Ghost Nisha series. Motoko Kusunagi known for her stoic personality, exceptional combat skill, and analytic mind. Her character explores the philosophical implication of merging technology with human existence as she grapples with questions about her own identity and the nature of consciousness. The narrative often delves into political intrigue, corporate espionage, and the ethical dilemmas posed by society dominated by advanced technology. Ghost Nisha has been featured in numerous adaptations, including animated film, television series, and video games. The most famous animated film is none other than Ghost in the Shell 1995, directed by Mamoru Oshii. Motoko Kusunagi's influence extends beyond the Ghost in the Shell franchise, impacting the cyberpunk genre as a whole. Her character has inspired discussion about the potential future of human-machine integration and the ethical challenge associated with advanced technology as a symbol of the intersection between humanity and, and artificial intelligence. Motoko Kusunagi continues to captive audience and provoke the thought of the involving relationship between human and technology. Thank you for watching and I will see you next time.